What's going on everyone? Welcome back to Better Biomed. It's a beautiful Texas morning out there and I'm already starting to sweat because uh, it's gonna be a beautiful day. Some balmy 95 degrees. So I figured I might as well get some of this stuff done first thing in the morning. And uh, today I wanna show you guys a trick I learned a long time ago when it comes to fasteners that are a little bit stripped out, especially in plastic. So this is just the perfect example. Let's go ahead and show you. All right guys, right here is my license plate holder and I absolutely hate when there are advertisements on my vehicle. I do not advertise for anybody. Notice how this one here is absolutely tight. See that? This one here will never tighten. It's extremely annoying. And the dealer thought it was okay to leave it like that. It's staggering how many people think that that's okay to just leave something half-assed. That license plate could have and probably would have eventually just fallen off. But as you can see, what I'm taking is a zip tie and you put it in the hole. And in this case, I'm gonna put it so the little notches that latch it are facing out. Then you thread the fastener in the hole. There it goes. And what it does is it tightens down those threads and it creates some new threads. You would not believe how difficult this is to do one hand. And when you get it partially down, you're going to clip it right down here at the base. See it? And then you finish sinking it in. Now this works particularly well on fasteners you aren't going to take out again or not for a very long time. And that is the perfect case scenario right here for my license plate holder. You're never gonna take that out again. Not until you sell the car, it's just the way it is. So, perfect application. And I still have a usable, sizable portion of a zip tie. Might save that for later. So anyway guys, if you were in a predicament where you cannot re-tap or re-thread the hole, I, I might actually go forth and drill out both of these holes and put in a, um, a nut cert. I don't know if you guys have ever seen that. I, I did a whole video on nut certs and it's basically almost like a popper of it, but it's threaded. They're kind of cool and I've, I've got a whole collection of them. That's also a perfect application for that because it's blind. You can't really access the backside of the hole. But uh, for right now, a little zip tie gets me up, gets me back up and going. And it technically is a permanent fix. I'll go, although this isn't a piece of medical equipment, if you're in a bind, just remember, you can always use something like this to create tighter threads and then get you until more permanent fix, right? Thanks for watching, guys.